Indy Hill building was built in 1889 by a Seattle pharmacist, Indy Hill, and he operated a pharmacy on the first floor. After that, uh, various people have owned the building and ran hotels and uh, taverns and restaurants down below. My family acquired the building in uh, 1989, and over the course of about two years, we did a major renovation to the top two floors and opened up the Water Street Hotel. Morning, Water Street Hotel, this is Mary. We do have rooms available. I think that you would probably really enjoy the water view suite up on the third floor. It has a full kitchen, a private bath, a king size bed, it has a sleeping loft, and then it's got a deck overlooking Port Townsend Bay. Beautiful room. You want to go ahead and get that room? Perfect. Okay, that would be great. The Water Street Hotel has some of the best views in the entire town. We're situated right on the waterfront. This is a great place to sit and relax, perched up here on the tallest point of the Water Street Hotel, watching the ferry go by and enjoying the beautiful view. People that run the hotel, Don and Chris, have done so much inside the building, restoring the building. It's beautiful, but it still has the restored history of the 1800s. One thing that people appreciate in Port Townsend and at the hotel, we have the Wi-Fi hookup, so you can bring your computer, you can plug in. You can relax, but you can also keep in touch. Depending on when you come to Port Townsend, because we have lots of events all throughout the year, we have the Blues Festival, Jazz Festival, and we have the Wacky Kinetic Race, which you have to build a vehicle that goes on the water and the land. While you're sitting on your deck outside the Water Street Hotel during the Kinetic Race, you might see a big green frog trying to race a magic yellow bus. Welcome to the Pacific Traditions Gallery inside the lobby of the Water Street Hotel. Once people walk into the lobby, they become really excited about the display of the native art. I have a lot of work in here that represents work by Coast Salish as well as Haida, Klinkit, Shimshin. These are drums that are done by Gary Bachman, who's Oglagla Lakota and lives right here in Port Townsend. His drums are our favorite here. When it gets really kind of quiet, I can drum. Everybody's welcome in Port Townsend. It's just a great place to enjoy being together, either romantically or with your family.